Hey guys! Oh my god, I know it's been like super long that I've done a YouTube what it's going on like almost two months, deals me on. Um, but I wanted to do like a quick little catch me up, what's been going on, what's been popping, what hasn't been popping, um, and a little bit of like what I am currently eating throughout the day. Um, Y'all know that I eat breakfast pretty late. It just it just kind of sort of happens, but we'll get to it in a little bit. Uh, this morning I'll be having some egg whites, two slices of turkey, bacon, and 27 grams of Kodiak protein pancake with my black coffee and my collagen and my stevia. I'm just kidding. But um, I'm just so happy, guys, because. I'm here. Like, uh, for those who aren't aware, last week in Texas was just, it was just really scary. Like, no kidding. It looked like zombie land out there. But I'm just really grateful to finally have power, running water, be able to get back on prep because the Lord knows. Last week, you know, no matter how much I tried to intuitively eat, there really wasn't many options that I could work into it. Um, but the thing is, I'm pretty good at just being okay with eating the same thing for weeks, for months. So I try to do what I can. Um, and I'll talk that talk about it more later. Um, but check out my cute little sweater. This is a size small in the Inaka crew neck. Um, it's not stretchy. So keep that in mind. Uh, I'm currently, I want to say like, 27 28 inch waist and my bust I want to say it's like 35 and then around I want to say it's like 32 33 but I'll double check my measurements and just uh, put them in the description below make sure to like the video comment like subscribe share with your friends and I will be back in a bit hello 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 so I just made my breakfast like this is like really close let me see closer further um i wanted to show you my breakfast so i'm just going to be having 27 grams of protein kodiak pancakes two slices turkey bacon a cup of egg whites and i want to say i did like 30 grams of spinach um i got my walden farms syrup oh trying to and it's zero cows i don't know why it's like not there we go Super good. Um, obviously my collagen, I'm almost out, so that's sad. I'm gonna do a scoop in my black coffee and three stevias. So, uh, that's my breakfast. Let me make my lip to collagen. I really wish that I could put this on something hot. Yeah! <laughs> sad, sad day. Uh, I don't know what it I should be getting in a new shipment in the next couple of days, so, oh, okay. Then, this is this. So this was the creamer that I was using, which is literally just, oh my God, the focusing on this. Literally only 15 cows, and it's really, really yummy. It's pecan caramel, and I also have like a hazelnut flavor. Um, this is pretty much what my fridge is looking like right now. I cannot live without hot sauce, y'all. Strawberries, pineapple, almond milk, regular milk, you know, you know, you know. So basically as like my cows start dropping, I start minimizing what I am able to flavor things with. Um, coffee creamer being one of the main things. So I just, I'll just drink it black with collagen and three stevias and I'm good. I mean, the creamer is like, um, like a treat, you can say, when I, whenever my cows are higher. But other than that. Just kind of suck it up, you know? Kind of keep pushing. Coffee is still life. Still life. But I did want to catch on, um, catch up on a couple of things. I don't know if I'm going to be doing some shredding just yet. Just to the fact that I don't know exactly when it's going to be. Because there's rumors that it's going to be back in summer. And for me, that's cutting it too short for the physique that I'm aiming for. So, God willing, I will be competing maybe towards the further end of the year. Like October, November. I know all the holidays. That's gonna... As of right now, I want to say I'm sitting at about anywhere from 1,500 to 1,600 calories. 
um, we're down to just one feeding at night and to be honest he doesn't it doesn't even last like more than three minutes so my calories are fine for right now um, if you are exclusively breastfeeding do not do not attempt that please please <laughs> your calories would be a lot would need to be a lot higher if you're exclusively breastfeeding and your baby isn't on solids or anything of that sort um with that being said I'm hungry Let me get back to you. So I always get asked, what supplements do you take? You, can you take fat burners? You're breastfeeding, so no fat burners while you're breastfeeding. But I do take my fish oils. You need your fish oils to straighten your joints, help them recover. I mean, after being pregnant, during your pregnancy, your baby is just soaking up all your vitamins. For, from your bones, from your joints, your muscles. I mean, we're pretty weak after birth. You know, I, so my friend Des launched her eyelashes. I don't know if you can, let me see you zoom in. How cute are these? I'm trying to see it. These are called the high maintenance. And I know you can't really see them like good, good, but it even comes with like a little brush. How neat is that to like brush out through your uh, eyelashes? I don't know if many of you like how long you use them, but I use them pretty often. Um, and I like to clean my eyelashes. And I also got the Left on Red. How cute are these? Amazing. Okay, there we go. And these are just really, like, you can literally see from the side. I know this isn't, like, wanting to focus, but they're so fluffy, guys. And if there's something that I love about eyelashes, is the eyelash <laughs> Can I see your hair, baby? <laughs> Guys, look at how long Lena's hair has gotten. Oh my goodness. And then look at how cute this bow is. Hold on, baby. Hey, touch it. Oh my gosh. She swears she didn't want to be on the YouTube. But she's... Hi, guys. Hi, guys. <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs> hey, guys. So Lena's actually a rep for Two Sisters Boutique. Um, I want to say that she's been a rep now for almost a year on and off But right now it's been like the longest time that she's had it because she just loves bows and she loves dressing up so Obviously, I'm gonna hype her up <laughs> She's about to be five. So I feel like this is like the most magical time for her She dresses up in tutus in her dresses big fluffy dresses She'll sometimes mix and match tutus jeans and I don't know but She's always trying to do something new and I just love it. So Two Sisters Boutique has been able to just help me recreate all of the ideas that Lena loves. And I'll show you in a little bit like our little collection that we have. Come here. Look at all these toys, guys. Jesus Christ. And I kid you not, I kid you not, I clean like three, five times a day. And it just never ends. So we're back. That's snack time. So, a lot of things that, a lot, one of the things that I always get asked is how do you measure your food out? Want some more pineapple? So right now I'm going to be having my second snack of the day. And then after that, to be honest, I save everything for late at night because that's the only time that I've been able to study. And by that time, I am hungry and I want munch. So I'd rather just, you know, save my snacks for later on, on that evening. Snack no middle dough. What are you eating? 
hijo es so carico, mamores. Lunch is ground beef with some potatoes and carrots. Yo, I don't like Some carrots. cheese. Don't give me carrots with it. Yes, you're eating carrots. No! Yes! I don't want to! You're gonna. No. Lina, da vera chapa. No. Yeah? Okay, no Doritos then. Fine, I will eat it. <laughs> you okay? Meanwhile, he eats everything. What are you eating? Strawberry. <laughs> what? Tell us what you're eating, baby. Carrots. Carrots? And what else? Uh, ketchup. Mm-hmm. Rice. Y carnita. Mmm, qué rico. <laughs> yeah, bye-bye. Yeah, first I'm eating. Yeah? Meanwhile. and I think this is crooked, crooked. So, as you just saw, I made a big, gigantic taco. Um, the tortilla that I'm using, it's by Joseph's, uh, Joseph's Wraps. It's uh, made out of flax, oat bran, and whole wheat. Macros are pretty darn good. 80 cows, 2.5 grams of total fat, um, carbs, 12, protein, 7 grams, not bad at all. It looks, I mean, I mean, you saw how good this looks. I did five ounces of ground, 99 ground turkey breast, um, seven grams of cheese, and I wanna say like 25 to 30 grams of spinach. Um, but I like to, that's why I spread it, my spinach out in breakfast and in here, so it's like a total of 60 grams, and then I'll just add an additional 20 grams to my 84 grams of spinach for dinner, and dude, oh my God. I just need some hot sauce. This is like my favorite because it reminds me of like Mexico whenever I was younger. But this is a hot sauce that goes super hard. Oh my god, it's mom. But. I'm about to devour this and I'll be back with y'all. Okay guys, so I am on my cycle at the moment. So something that I really go by is chamomile tea mixed with my shield. Um, I get really bad allergies. It's like they overreact whenever I'm on my cycle for some odd reason. I mean, it's like our bodies are vulnerable, right? Whenever we're on our cycle. So I'll do a little bit almost a full scoop about a third uh two thirds of the scoop dip it in there and then i'll do my chamomile tea and i'll just do one little tea bag and i'll let it steep for at least like 30 minutes and then if it's still really hot i'll let it still continue to steep but it helps so much with my cramping my headaches, my overall allergies. And the shield is actually from 
BioHealth. I actually got to use it uh, as a free sample and I really like the flavor. With the Chamomile tea alone, I don't think I could be able to take it. But with the Chamomile tea, it gives it an extra like um, ginger kick and it just opens up all of this and it just I just really, really enjoy it. I'll just let that sit there for a little bit. Let me show you. So this is basically what it looks like with the shield and the little tea bag in there. And I'll just let it steep for a good 30 minutes and then I'll chug it. As far as my next snack, I am actually going to be having a Jombani yogurt. And oh my God, my favorite one right now is the key lime. Oh my God, this bad girl is just so good. It, oh, it's just really good. Or the mango because it has like fresh mango pieces under it. And then I'll have my dinner and then I'll have two rice cakes and seven, no, 15 grams of jelly and that's it. That's all I get to eat right now. So I know it's not like as fun as my refeed days, but hopefully I get to blog a refeed day very soon. I don't think I'll be having one to be honest for like two weeks because I basically had like a refeed week <laughs> with the storm. So, so, she's so cute. But all right guys, I'll be back. We baked in some super sweet of rice, three ounces of it, and then this one, extra olive oil spray. I actually found it at Costco. Mm. And then I'm gonna be having some chipotle chicken with some spinach. We made it to the end of the day. Um, I just made my dinner which is five ounces of air, air fried chipotle chicken breast with 100 grams of spinach and three ounces of sweet potato rice with some lemon. Mm -mm -mm. Get some of that chicken breast. And then I'm going to do a little salt. And then I'll be drinking, so I only like to drink like half of my little ice waters, like half during lunch, half for dinner. So I still have like my same drink. And then my last snack of the day will actually be two rice cakes and 15 grams of jelly. And that's it, y'all. I know it wasn't as exciting. And half of the time I was really, really just like blabbing off. Um, I don't know, like after not blogging for so long, I kind of get shy again. So, <laughs> I, but I'm trying to shake it off. Oh, it got cold outside. The baby's just left. Um, with Noe, they wanted to go get a happy meal, so they're gonna be eating a happy meal for dinner. Um, as we conclude this video, remember to like, subscribe, share, comment below. I would really like to get some feedback from y'all. I know I always ask you this, but y'all never really like comment what y'all wanna see, what y'all would like to see. Um, as far as recipes, I think in the last video, I did like three recipes. Um, but I'm just trying to get more creative and I don't know what to do. So help me out there. Um, just let me know. And I will see y'all next time.